And in this video, we are going to be doing Iron Man by Black Sabbath. So, this, uh, the metal effect that I have is on the screen right now. I'm using a pedal called Metal Zone. And you can get it for a couple bucks. And make sure your guitar is standard tuning before we begin. So, the first note we're going to play, by the way, is going to be on the low E, the very top string. And we're going to go ahead and put your finger on the kind of like the behind the neck and you're going to bend it as you strum. So do that about three times before you play the riff. Alright, in order to do that, we're gonna go ahead and Put our either your middle finger or your index finger on the A string and we're gonna play a B. Yeah, if you cannot really see clearly, I have the tabs on top as well. And we're gonna go ahead and play it like this. So slide over to D. So B. So B D E, and you will have something like this first. And then after that, we're going to go ahead and slide over to the 10th fret, same string, but you're going to go ahead and slide like this. So make sure you got it like... Directly after doing that, you slide back to D and finish off on an E, so your final result is... is going to be, we're going to play first on a, on a B, so it's going to be the low E string, we're going to play a B chord like this. So go. So basically repeat that about three times, so I'm going to go ahead and play B, then D. So. If you can look, it'll be like... So, repeat that and when you end it, you're gonna end on an A, so like this. And then you go ahead and play the same riff. Yeah, that is after you do that. So go ahead, let me do it one more time and you'll see how it goes. Then you do the exact same. So now, that is simply for the first verse, the second verse, and then for the what bridges between the first and the second verse. Now we're gonna go ahead and do the chorus now. So we're gonna strum an E. So after the you do your riff, right? Like Yeah, we'll get into that one later, but for the chorus, simply start with an E power chord. Slide to a D, so... Now, this is personal preference. You can also do this if you want to, like... Now, but personally, I like to use a um, chord up here instead of using the bar chord. I'd rather use an E. Because for me personally, I like the, I prefer this effect when I slide down, but 
it's personal preference either way is correct, but for to make this easier, let's use the bar chord itself. So, so basically, you strum E about twice, then palm mute. So, I'm gonna go ahead and play on on the low E, play on the tenth fret, then go down down here to the A string. So you will get something like. So that is the next step after you've got the down. But that's the entire chorus. So play it one more time for you. So that's that's um the chorus. And the, after the first chorus, you go ahead and repeat the riff again. Then you know how the, how the rest goes. Now. I'm gonna go ahead and get to the actual bridge itself, which you play something like. Then there's the whole solo. So now that is very simple. Go ahead and play on the on the 11th fret. We're gonna go ahead and mess the D string when we play this, and it's going to be. So you're gonna go ahead and play. Um, 11th fret, the 9th fret is for the D string, then above this you're gonna go to the A string and play all three frets. Then repeat that twice. Alright, so that is the first um, part of Black Sabbath, so you have learned how to do the intro, the verse riffs, the chorus, and then the bridge. So. I will see you guys in part two of this tutorial.